okay, the person with the back to the camera is always the attacker on this video. Now, I'm playing the attacker, and I'm going after my student, and they're learning the open the gate technique. It's a self-defense technique against someone that's going to push you. This is something I teach young police officers who might get pushed into traffic or over a guardrail or into some other compromising position by someone who's much stronger. So what the practitioner will do, my student will do, is try to hold back the attacker as long as he can, and then when he runs out of strength, he'll release all his energy, get out of the way, and pull him, and steer him. And so he goes over. So what can happen here, you can get a very small police officer, a very small self-defense student that can actually throw a much stronger attacker to the ground by just loading him up. So she's gonna load me up, she's gonna push me hard as she can, as if she wants to get into a pushing contest with me. So the stronger attacker thinks they're going to win, and then you release the energy, and away you go. And as you saw last week, we practice steering, which is a wrestling technique to set each opponent up for a takedown. Well, this time they're using the steering uh, just to release the energy and to throw them. And with steering, we can use any handle on the upper body. We can use the elbows, we can use the lats, we can use the head, like from a collar type position. We can use the upper arm, and away we go even a situation here where, where one of the students uses the elbow, which is actually a, a long fulcrum for this type of a throw, and it worked fantastic. So here's Gladys again. I'm going to try to drive Gladys against her cruiser, and oh, I'm going to end up against the cruiser. And this is only one night. We learned this all one night. That's how easy this is. It's a great technique, and it's easy for them because it's part of their wrestling skills and just using self-defense.